What's going on? This is my first official tutorial for Unity, and it's going to be basically how to make a old CRT style kind of curved screen. It's something I wanted to do forever, and it finally hit me last night, an easy way to do it in Unity. So I'm just going to dive right in, and let's go. Off here, and boom! Something like that. All right, let's dive in. We will go ahead and, and I'm, I'm gonna include um, links to the 3D model that I'm using. Um, and I might even just go ahead and include the actual package. This is gonna be Unity 2019.1, so get with the fucking times or whatever. You could still do this in older versions of Unity. It's not really that big of a deal. It's something, a uh, very common feature. Um, so we'll go make a new project. I would recommend it in 3D. Even if you're making a 2D game, it, it doesn't matter. Um, we'll call this um, CRT screen. Screen. Screen tutorial. We'll then create the project. Oh, no, we gotta, we're gonna switch. 2019. I need that 2018 bullshit. It's 2019. It's it's official. And we'll sit here and we'll watch this um, load real quick. Even on a fast computer like this, it still takes a little bit of time. Don't worry, it's gonna happen. You can always fast forward. This is a YouTube video. You can do that. This is not a live stream. Duck. What? Unity is about to delete all it. Just do, do what you gotta do. Just, just get out of my way. Okay. We're in the project now. I do is fail to destroy these. Whatever. I, I don't give a shit. Um, need to. Go ahead and find my asset. Um, downloads. It is tv01.obj. Oh, no, we don't do it that way. We gotta just drag it in there. Like I said I'll include a link to it. Um, I didn't make this, by the way. Okay, so we got this in here. And I'm gonna go ahead and find the camera is facing this way so we'll go ahead and i'll just control hold rotate that and boom now what i like to do here is i want to see the game view constantly so i just drag it over there like this and that is the main camera right there so what i want to do is I want to get out of the main camera. I don't like how it shows that. Go ahead and um, go ahead and make a um. I'll just make a, a plane. What I actually want to do is I want to reset this to that, but the rotation's fine. So we'll just go ahead with the boom, 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 boom. Um, why the position changing? That doesn't make any sense. I want the, I'm really like particular about how things are here. So I don't like weird numbers. Minus eight. Cut that off. Um, actually, I should be keeping track of the time. So come on, flow. Then start the timer. 30 minutes. I should be able to do this pretty quick though. Um, Okay, so we got that set up like I want it, basically, for now, how I, how I want it. And we'll go ahead and create a 3D object of a plane, plain old plane. And we'll just move that way over here. Get, get it out of that camera view is what I want. We're gonna make another camera. Right click, 
camera and I want this camera to actually a plane object was not not what I want I mean you could make a 3d style game I'm actually going for a 2d style game so what I want actually is a cube I'll bring it up I need to go ahead and project in perspective orthographic see how that's how we do that now we're now we're cooking with fire and I don't want that stupid skybox there so we'll go solid color and then let's just go ahead and um just simple all right there's this you want to unpack the prefab it doesn't matter really if it's completely or not and then what you want to do is you want to click on that and make sure that monitor is selected and what I like to do is just drag that to the top of the TV and I want to just call that underscore screen just uh, TV screen just one of the, one, that needs to stand out from the other things honestly because that's what we're working with here and what we want to do is right click create render texture and just call this um tv tv screen render texture yeah it's something simple like that um and what we want to do is drag it to that tv screen right now we got nothing that's all right because simple as that we will go ahead with this camera target texture drag it to that boom there you go there's your curved screen and you do it any way you want but the way I want it is like that kind of something like that maybe maybe a little closer I've done this before um, really got a little bit of there's so many things I could do to make this better too, of course. But as far as I know, there's really not any tutorials on how to do this. And it's simple. I mean, there's tutorials on how to do this. Basically, with the target texture thing. But, um... So, basically, you'll have your game over here. And... Beep, 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 beep. It's really simple. I'm not doing a tutorial on how to make a game, by the way. I'm doing a tutorial on how to make a certain style here that we want. Now, another thing I'm going to add is I'm going to find um, the shader that I want. There's all kinds of shaders you can get, by the way, to make this look more like a CRT screen. One thing I don't like is I'll go to this TV camera and change the solid color to like a more of a yeah and what's really cool is you, you've got the light reflecting off of it you've got shadows um you, you can adjust all that um you get a better screen if you're good with blender or whatever you can get something a little better this one's pretty low poly to be honest um if you don't want the rest of that tv it's in pieces um like i said i'll put a link it's on uh, turbo squid like eight minutes okay let's try to keep this about to a 15 minute tutorial for one more thing I'm going to add is something. If I can find it, my documents, Unity projects, Atari 2600 assets, and there is a realistic glitches light. Um, I'll put a link to that as well because that's where I got this shader called. But I can't find it. Fucking must have moved it. <laughs> Bear with me here. This is not, not good. Scan lines, I think. I think it's scan lines. And then just go ahead and add that to the, um... Oh, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm bad here. I need to go ahead and move the entire... Realistic glitches light to this real quick. Um... 
and then hope that something doesn't screw up like it's wanting to act like it's going to do assets scripts your effect oh, i hate this this is pissing me off Seator effect crt needs to go to the tv camera boom you got the scan lines now i take the intensity down about 25 you can get other, like i said i've seen others too where the scan lines actually kind of move i could probably you know i know enough about playing with shaders i could probably do that but like i said i think that looks pretty cool and let's go ahead and see what it looks like full screen oh derp um okay there's a problem there and and it's the free ass i can't see okay so what it looks like is i need to take this camera move it over move it up oh god i don't like that um So my camera is not doing what I want. One thing I can do is just go ahead and just resize. Let's um see if that helps. Still not really like doing what I want. I want this camera to. This is probably the field of view I use last week. Well. Okay, so it's like one of those things where I gotta adjust until I'm. Which is basically more like the frame. And then I can just go ahead and. Okay, that's really weird. I don't like that. Why are you acting like that, dude? Come on. So, is that what I get when I change camera settings? There we go. So it's something you can play around with, and um, I just want to see it in full view now. Yeah, that's not you know, it's not great with the camera centering, but you know I've done a better job, as you can see in, in the the picture that I had up earlier. And that is what I got. So if you have any questions um, about or need any help with this, feel free to comment. Um, also, I'll put a link to my Discord uh, and every other social media thing. I live stream pretty often, regularly, sort of. Um, so I'll have links to everything. My Discord, I got help channels for Unity, Blender, uh, Construct 2, and Unreal. Well, I don't really know much about Unreal, but you know, I think there might be a couple guys in my server. So that's what I'm kind of going for. I'm actually, um, and like I said, I can do it. Uh, help with a uh, unity if there's any requests for any other tutorials or anything let me know um, and if you like the video mash that like button subscribe yada 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 if you don't like it then you know just i i, I don't want to know you um go somewhere else uh no i'm just kidding i'm not that kind of attitude i'm just i'm just uh having fun but so this is my first tutorial and it's done so till next time this is Scarflaw, out.